I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Riding around on a bike all night. People think this job is about taking, but really we're out there delivering. Delivering grief, pain, depression. I'd prefer it was pizza, but it's not. Jeremy's too young to die. And I'm pregnant. There's time's up. There's, there's nothing I can do about it. I'm pregnant. I'm sorry, mate. It's a boy and a girl. Oh. I already told you I don't need no food. Mum's cooking at night. Like I said, mate, I haven't got any food to deliver, just your demise. My name is Stan. This off, mate. The customers I get, well, they're usually not too pleased. Some are pretty aggressive, but mostly they're just sad. Really sad. Yes, thank you. <laughs> So yeah, from the makeup to the night shifts to the unrewarding and often abusive interaction with customers, the job sucks. And the peanuts they pay, it's a joke. But you heard me bitch about that last week already, so I won't get into that now. But seriously, you know what the worst part of the job is? Is, is that I'm trapped. I mean, I don't know what else to do. There's, there's got to be more to life than just taking life, you know? You could at least play a game with me for once. Instead of talking rubbish like always? I've told you a hundred times, Joe. I don't know the rules. And I've told you a thousand times. I'll teach you, you idiot. I don't have time to spend here. I've got work again in six hours. I... Oh, yeah. Your secret job. <laughs> I shudder to think what you do out there at night. See you, Joe. Please, you can cut off my arms and legs. You can piss on me if you want. Uh, I'll do anything. I just can't die. I don't want to die. If I die, who will take care of Mrs. Potrose? Mrs. Potrose is a, a hamster? She's a guinea pig, you idiot. Your family will take care of it. She'll be fine. My family are Vietnamese. They will cook and eat her. They've tried to before. I'm sorry, but you're not the first to beg for your life to be spared. I get this every single time. I can't do anything about it. I'm sorry. I don't believe Truly, you. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, hey. Have it. Don't cry. Have a tissue. Don't apologize to me, you little bitch. If you actually cared, you at least try. Oh my god. What? We should play chess. Can we play chess, please? In this movie, this guy plays a game of chess with death. And if he wins, death spares his life. What happens if death loses? I don't know. I haven't seen it. Looks old AF and boring AF. I don't have time for your games. I've got 11 more lives to end tonight. Just so. try. I don't know how to play chess. I don't know the rules. Then we'll play something else then. Um, Okay, so if I win, your life is spared, but you gotta take my job. And if I win, I get to keep my life as a stay-at-home dad with Mrs. Buttrose and live happily ever after. But we still don't know what happens if I lose. Maybe you die. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Are you sure this is going to work? No, not at all, I only agreed, because you're crying. Ugh, I hate beer. I wish we played chess. Wait, this is Australia. B is good. You ready? Ready, set, go.